today I thought I would make a quick video just taking a look at the Origin uh, 315P. The 315P, this is a Pathfinder exploration uh, ship and well the reason that I actually like this ship, the reason I got this ship is <clears throat> because of its quantum fuel tank capacity for a small ship, for a small sort of fighter size ship uh, it actually has a, a uh, sorry a quantum fuel capacity which exceeds pretty much most other ships it seems to be the best of its class basically best of the small ships uh, most ships will have about 560 uh, quantum fuel capacity whereas the origin 315p has 830 <clears throat> hydrogen capacity which basically allows you to travel further and if you just kind of want a bit of a runabout ship then the Origin 315P makes a heck of a good little runabout ship. Now unfortunately 300 and uh, sorry the 830 Thank you. fuel is not necessarily enough to jump you as far as you'd want to go in a single jump. So um, the idea of this being your go-to transport ship is kind of unfortunately not going to work that well. It's unfortunate because it seems like a great little explorer ship. Um, <clears throat> so with a, a full fuel capacity and starting from where am I? I am at Microtech. So starting from Microtech at 830 fuel capacity, just to give you an idea of how far that will take you, uh, will it take you to Delamar? Yes, but just barely. Uh, will it take you to uh, <laughs> Hurston? Yes, just barely. Will it take you to Crusader? No. <clears throat> Crusader will require quite a bit more quantum fuel. So you are looking at about roughly the ability to travel half of the half of the solar system in a single jump. So if you don't have to go too far, that's not too bad. But if you have to go any further than about half of a solar system, it's kind of, uh, unfortunately, it's kind of, it, it doesn't accomplish that. Uh, which would, it would be cool if it did. It would be cool if you could have a bit of a runabout sort of scout exploration ship that could transport you from place to place when you just need to transport your own personal self. <clears throat> I am, for example, headed to Lauraville here today to pick up a, a, a new ship. And uh, it will get me there, but, you know, if I was on Crusader, it certainly <clears throat> wouldn't do the trick. Um, but, yeah, let's uh, just take a quick look here. <clears throat> I'm going to enter into hyperspace. And then, what's kind of cool about this little, you know, fighter-sized ship, basically, is you've actually got a bit of, you've actually got a bit of, of passenger space, right? Or you got your little, you got your little sleeping room. You got your sink, you could wash your hands, you could do all that sort of great stuff. Some glasses of wine. Great, that's great. And what I also thought was really cool about the design on this ship was this this glass canopy. So if you are touring around, again, which is the idea, which is again kind of created, uh, defeated a little bit because this, this ship can only jump, you know, half a solar system at a time. But if you wanted to tour around and check out planets and just ch you know check out the uh, the geography and the environments and that sort of thing, what a great little touring ship! This is just a, a beautiful, beautiful design. Handles really nice. It flies, you know, it's really easy to fly. Um, and yeah, it's you know above average, above the normal amount of quantum fuel. So better than the other options. Perhaps still not better, better than the other options. Still not what I would have wanted necessarily but certainly better than the other options and there she is a, uh, like I say a quick look at the 315p my thoughts on it it's a usefulness versus you know what what you can really do with it um, not quite as much as I had wanted not quite as much as I hoped but uh, yeah a couple other notes uh, it's got two size 3 um, guns so that's uh, pretty 
pretty lackluster amount of firepower compared to like a fighter, but still, two size 3 guns is not too bad. That's actually the same as the Mercury Star Runner has uh, available to its pilot. So, you know, t you can do some stuff with two size 3 guns. By comparison, you know, the Aegis uh, Sabre has four size 3 guns, so this comes in at about half the firepower. It's got some missiles, and it's got... Uh, it's got two size 1 uh, shield generators, so all in all, it's a decent little ship. I wouldn't specialize, you know, in any sort of fighting or... Ex I wouldn't take it... and I wouldn't necessarily take it exploring because it doesn't go far enough. I wouldn't take it fighting because it's not strong enough. Um, but if, you know, you wanted to fly around a planet and just check out the environment of a planet, I would say this would be a great little ship to do that in. It would be uh, certainly pretty cool. It doesn't have enough space, of course, for a vehicle or anything like that, so you can't get out of it and explore around the surface. But, uh, yeah, if you just want to fly around and check out uh, the terrain, this is this would be a cool ship to do it in, for sure. So I hope you liked this video. Quick little review on 315P, and I'll see you all maybe in the next video.